So welcome to my classic horror movie trailer reaction series. I've been doing a whole bunch of these for Halloween and hopefully suggesting some amazing classic horror films to people who've not necessarily seen these yet. Now, Evil Dead was an amazing horror film. I did a reaction to that a couple nights back, and it's one of my all-time favorite films. So if one film was really ripe for a remake, it was The Evil Dead. It wasn't polished, it was pretty shoddy, it was made by friends on no budget, just uh, have some fun. But getting the full big budget treatment is is something to behold. So Fetty Alvarez had the opportunity to give us a remake back in 2013. Now bear in mind this is the Red Band trailer so I don't know if this one's going to be monetized or not. It's fairly heavy hitting so if you are a little bit nervous about gore be aware that this one does go pretty off the chain. It's relentless in its gore but it's, it's done beautifully and it's shot well and I just love it. It really kind of took the essence of that original Evil Dead film and, and treated it with love and respect and delivered something unique and, yeah, really quite affecting. So without further ado, let's dive into the Evil Dead official full-length Red Band trailer. I remember the first time I saw this, I was like, what the hell? All right, three, two, one, go. I've warned you. This is full-on. But the movie is amazing. I think Sam Raimi was actually producer in this as well. So you got your cabin in the woods. Please. You have a brother and sister and a group of friends. You have to get me out of here. Chaos ensues and this one has no loss in it man. It's strictly terror and horror. This book alone. And violence and gore. It's wonderful. You don't understand. Done with today's special effects. We've got the Book of the Dead. Unleashes the demons. And I think it's in here with us now. What they do. <laughs> so that the tree rape scene from the original movie in this one. Never comfortable to watch. something from that book something evil this thing is attached to me as soul <laughs> this is really good man her. I've seen this movie about three times you are all going to die tonight <gasps> yep <laughs> yep yep Holy shit, yep. Oh my god. Yeah, it doesn't hold back on the blood. Oh fuck, man. Hell yeah. <laughs> Oh man, it's it's a hard it's a hard hitting film. They really kind of go to town on the violence and the gore, like I said, but they they do retain that initial essence of that first film. And it's not a direct retelling either. They do kind of give us a few twists and turns in it, so the story still kind of surprises you and delights you in its in its delivery. But yeah, if you're not really big on the gore, then don't go near this one. It is very very serious. There's no tongues in cheeks. We've got split tongues. I mean. As you can see, it's uh, it's really amazing with the special effects, and it's balls to the wall horror. It doesn't take any levity or give us any jokes. It just is out to scare you. I was impressed with it. Like so, when they announced they were doing a sequel, I was very apprehensive. So, Fetty Alvarez really kind of delivers us something really amazing. It's a, it's one of those rare times that uh, a remake is actually almost as good or better than its original film. So I really recommend you check this one out because because like I said leading up to Halloween it's the perfect time to be watching all these horror films and if you've not seen these ones yet then yeah I, I endorse this one is awesome. Anyway guys I'm going to do a few more reactions today so I'll get back to you with more classic horror films so I really think you should check out. I'll catch you then. Thanks for watching.